everyone, it's Tiffany. I am going to be picking five random blind bags or boxes to open up today. Let's get started. All right, we have the TLC Critters and the Mad Lab Untamed Minis. Let's see what else we can find in here. Oh my gosh, this is, this is crazy. Hold on, <laughs> my hand's stuck. There's so much stuff in here. It looks like we have the Briar Mystery Horse Surprise, and we have a Grumbly's Maniacs. All right, we just need one more. One more, you guys. So I'm gonna go over to this side and see what I can find. I got like a whole handful of things, of course. How about we open up the, oh, I guess not that one. Let's open up the Fingerlings Minis. Let's go ahead and see what we got inside each pack. Let's start with the Grumbly's Miniacs. Small size, major meltdown. This is series one. Let's go ahead and see which cool little crazy Grumbly we are going to find inside. All right, let's move those back so they're not in the way. I see hair. All right, so we have this obviously, which we can, if we had others, we can connect and make a cool display. And we have our checklist. Now I do see purple hair, so I'm assuming it's either Bolt or Spark, but these are all of the characters that we can collect in series one. I specifically love these ones, the fiery ones and the icy ones. They're so cool, but there's so many awesome ones. I love them all. Let's open this up and we have, wait, this one is Bolt. Bolt is so cool. I love his face. And these are kind of like pencil toppers. They're the can be pencil toppers. They are just like a hard rubber. Um, they are pretty solid here. And they have this hair here at the top, this little tuft of hair. So they don't actually do anything. They're not like actual grumblies where they like melt down, but they are so cool. I love them. And we're gonna put him back there while we open up our fingerlings minis. This is series three and there's many different characters we can collect. And obviously I wanna find somebody other than a monkey. No offense to the monkeys, you know. Let's see. And we have a monkey. <laughs> it's okay, monkey, it's okay. Uh, let's see, is this actually you right here? No, that's not, I thought it was. Let's get the little list out. This is, I thought that said corn. I was like, is your name corn, what? This is Cam. This is Cam, she's just a popular, so basically a common. And you can see here, there's a bunch of different uh, monkeys and unicorns and sloths and even a dragon and a giraffe in the popular section and then there's Jewel. And then on the back we have the rares and then the legendaries and obviously I want the legendaries, obviously, because you know, they're the hardest ones to get. And then we have this cool little vine that we can hang our monkey from and we can go ahead and connect this to other things or whatever, or make it into a bracelet, really fun. And moving on, let's go ahead and open up this Briar Mystery Horse Surprise. If we flip it over, these are all of the ones we can find inside, or possible ones we can find inside. I really want to find this white one. And then there's also a Mystery Horse, which would be nice to find. I also want to find this one right here. Let's see what we have. Oh, nothing. Not, not what I wanted, but that's cool. This one's really pretty. We have this one right here really beautiful i love it i like the position that this one is in the tail is blowing in the wind as well just look at the paint like the the shading on this one it just looks so good oh my goodness i love it it looks fabulous and then these are just a hard plastic figure all right guys we are moving right along we have the mad lab minis next these are really cool i can't wait to see which one we got i think we have sand in here is that sand let's see Let's, let's see. Okay, <laughs> finally got it. <laughs> we do have our checklist here. Go ahead and cut that off. And it does look like, oh, maybe not. That might be like putty. So we do have the checklist here. So many different ones we can find. Really crazy. And here's some more. I just want to find all of them. They're so cool. 
And I'm trying to find which one this is particularly. Why is this not opening? There we go. So let's take this off here. Where's our little pull tab? Oh, that didn't work very well. That's okay. We'll just uh, keep working with it, get that all the way off. And we do have our little character here. The head and body come separate. That is one nice, awesome feature. We can actually swap them with other characters and make hybrids. Now this one here, I'm trying to find on the checklist. It's not, not the easiest. I don't think he's on this. Oh wait, this might be, might be overkill. Might be, he's not brown, but he might be. Let's just take a look, see on this side. Yeah, I'm definitely, I'm definitely thinking this is overkill. Now we do have a cool textured putty in here. Now they do come in a variety of um, solutions, if you will. So we have, I know there's sand ones, there's slimy, barrel slimy ones, and there's this kind of like putty textured one. This is really awesome, I like this one. Really stretchy and really moldable. Now I'm wondering if I can make footprints with this one. Oh, you can, it's kind of very faint. I think that's one of my favorite things about these. They have texture on the bottom of their feet so they can make really cool tracks. So when you have like the sand one, it just looks really extra good. But you can kind of see there's some prints in the sand there. And then there you can do like a little scratch it. <laughs> I love it. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. But yeah, this is what we got here. And you can take his head off. He still has some putty left on off to get that off. But he's really, really cool. He's definitely, definitely one of my faves. Okay, well, I don't know. I can't pick a favorite. They're all so cool. We have the TLC Critters next. And let's see which one we are going to be opening up. I do have a bowl of water back there because we are going to need to check this out. By the way, these are the ones you can collect here on the back. Let's all tree open. Let's see. Okay, we're in. So this is our little incubator. Let's go ahead and open this up. Oh my gosh, and I'm throwing things around. Now, might need to read the instructions. It's been a little while since I've opened these, but we can go ahead and uh, close that up. That's our little incubator there. We do get some instructions here. We can, well, we got to reveal if it's a boy or a girl by throwing the packet into the water. We can feed our little friend. We can change the diaper and stuff like that. Let's see which little friend we got. Actually, did I not get a checklist? Oh, wait, the checklist is probably inside. Hi, little friend. We got a little polar bear. What a cutie. Oh, my goodness. This one's adorable. And we're going to go ahead and throw this packet in the water. Boy or girl put in water to reveal. I see pink. I see pink, everybody. It's a girl! I know you guys can't really see back there, but let me uh, let me get this all back out. Probably should have brought a paper towel or something to dry this off. We have the girl. Let's go ahead and open this. Oh wait, it didn't open. Let's open it again. <laughs> okay, my hand is soaking wet. Let's try to, I'm gonna try to dry it off over here. Now let's get this stuff out of here. Yeah, I gotta bring a paper towel next time, or a towel. So we do have the little certificate of adoption, and it's a girl. And then we have our checklist. Let's check it out. Okay, let's see right away who we got. We have Sophie Snowball, she's so cute. And these are all the other friends we can find. We turn it over. We have a newborn animal log. Each surprise bag comes with a bottle or medicine dropper to help you take care of your newborn animals. So there's like little schedules and then their mood in the day. I think that's so cute. Now if we do dig over in the water, we'll find some of the things we got. So we did get the little eyedropper, we got a little crown, and we got a pacifier. So you can definitely feed your little critter water through the eyedropper. And you can go ahead and put the little pacifier in. And you can change the diaper and stuff like that. I want to see. My hands are very slippery right now. Let's see if I can take off the diaper. Because if you dip it in water or, I guess, you know, feeder, it can change color. 
So you can see there's a little emoji there. Let's see if it works. Okay, it kind of worked. It's still a little faint, but it's definitely a pea. <laughs> it's yellow. It comes in yellow or brown. And we do have the tiara. Like that. This is so cute. I love this. Leave me a comment down below and let me know which of these characters is your favorite that we opened up today. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe and I will see you next time.